Welcome to my CCNA training series. My name is Trevor. This video is going to discuss the physical layer. The physical layer is layer 1 on the OSI and the TCP IP updated models. This layer is where the actual connections between devices occur. At this layer, the connection data is referred to as bits. Everything is a bunch of ones and zeros at this point. The sole responsibility of layer 1 is to move these bits from one device to another. The physical layer is almost entirely documented in standards that are written by other organizations, and these describe the physical characteristics of data transmission. These characteristics include types of cables, connectors, pinouts, voltage, electrical currents, and wire speeds. You should always start with layer 1 physical when you're troubleshooting an issue first. Think about it for a second. Why would you start troubleshooting a complicated routing issue first if the device isn't even plugged in and cabled correctly? Devices that exist at the physical layer are hubs and repeaters. It's an extremely important concept for you to understand that hubs and repeaters, they only amplify a signal. They don't actually segment a network. Every interface off of a hub and repeater are in the same collision domain, so that means that collisions can happen as bits are transmitted between different interfaces on those devices. We'll talk about that a little bit more in upcoming videos. All data, no matter where it's sent, will eventually become layer 1 bits as they're transmitted over a medium. As we start discussing binary in these upcoming videos, this layer will slowly start making more and more sense. I hope this video was helpful for you. Please click on the link in the description section to see the entire CCNA series playlist. Please leave any questions or comments you have in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.